Hello, I am back again with another video. Thought I was through, nope, I'm back. I got more music, more miscellaneous stuff to haul about. But this time, I'm focusing on cassettes. So let's get started. In no particular order, I'm just grabbing this is Andy Summers, Robert Fripp, I Advance Mask. This is the first, this is a, basically a guitar instrumental album by the guitarist from The Police and uh, Robert Fripp. Um, and this is his first solo album after The Police. This is a really good album. The Cocteau Twins, Garlands. This is the debut album of the British new Neo uh, punk man. What else do we have? A nine and a half week soundtrack. A saucy movie if you ever seen it. But this has some of the best. This is a great soundtrack. Probably one of the best soundtracks in the 1980s. I would say so. We have Joe Cocker. We have the Eurythmics. Brian Ferry. Slave to Love is on there. Uh, Devo. Um, Corey Hart. A lot of these cassettes were either my dad's or my uncle's, and some of them are mine. Next we have Phoebe Snow, Never Letting Go. Phoebe Snow has a great voice. What a great voice see Phoebe Snow has. R&B, just classic music. Very classy, very classy music. I think that's from the 80s. Patrice Ruchin, watch out. What's the year is this? 1987. Jamiroquai, The Return of the Space Cowboy. This is such a such a, a chill album. This is their second album. I love this record. The Return of the Space Cowboy, Light Years, Manifest Destiny. That's one of my favorite songs of all time. Next we have Prince and the Revolution. Um, Around the World in a Day. This is After Purple Rain. Classic album, love that album. Tori Amos, Boys for Pelly. This is a very odd album. Very, one of, uh, came out in 96. Just, she was using a lot of different instruments in that album. Just very, but very, very, very interesting album. I don't know, I haven't listened to it in a while, if it's still growing on me, but moving on, Sting, The Soul Cages, 1991. This is a classic from Sting. This is a, this is a central Sting album there. Next up we have Plus From Us, Peter Gabriel. This is a compilation album of mostly like uh, world music artists. Uh, I know Brian uh, Eno has some songs on here. I forgot who else is on there, but um, it came out in the early 90s. Speaking of the police, we got Police Synchronicity. Probably their greatest album, 1983, their last album. Next, we have Toto, Fahrenheit. Toto, they were a great production, great music, great band. Another Peter Gabriel, so this is the classic Peter Gabriel. This is his, probably his most popular album. This has a uh, Sledgehammer and Don't Give Up on there. Next up we have, speaking of 80s classic, Paul Simon, Graceland. Love Paul Simon. You know, gotta have, gotta have, you can call me Al. Gino Vanelli, A Pauper in Paradise. This is 70, yeah, late 77, I think. Yup, I had it right. Next we have Prince Parade. This is Prince and the Revolution. You know, this is what Kiss is on. Moving on, Melba Moore, A Lot of Love. I forgot what's on this album. Let's look and see. Yeah, this is like late 80s, but oh, I love this one right here. It's one of my favorite singers, Al Jarreau, Ellis for Lover. One of my favorite tracks. Tell Me What I Gotta Do is on here. But you got love Al Jarreau. Levert. Gerald Levert. Just coolin'. We are cool. New Jack Swing. Let's see. Some of these don't have cases, but Brian Ferry, Boys and Girls, 80s classic. 
80s essential. Next up we have, what's going on? Brother, brother, what's going on? I play this on rainy days, what's going on? It just works perfectly on rainy days. George Michael, Listen Without Prejudice, 1990. It has freedom on it. Some smooth jazz, Najee, day by day. The saxophone, speaking of smooth, Michael Franks, Tiger in the Rain. Talk about smooth. That's one of my, that's probably my favorite Michael Franks album. And if you're into cassettes, you know what this is. It's a mixtape, Sound of the 70s, and then Sound of the 90s and 70s. This was definitely my uncle's. Somebody made him a mixtape. So these are old, he's back in the day for real. Some of these are like, uh, a lot of these, these bad boys, these are old house, old Chicago original house cassettes that I need to digitize and put on YouTube or something. Well, maybe not YouTube, but I know it's some classic house on there. Stevie Wonder, Inner Visions, classic, classic Stevie. Oh, we got a uh, Hiroshima, uh, another place. This has a um, smooth, smooth jazz instrumental, you know, that, that whole smooth jazz mu movement that was going on, uh, easy listening. We got a... Uh, Patty, Patty LaBelle and the Bluebells. This is from 1988. Oh, I guess that's a Christmas album. Another Sting, Tin Sumner Tale. That has um, his uh, famous Fields of Gold. Philip Bailey from Earth, Wind and Fire, Inside Out. I don't know what the singles are on here, but Philip, ba Philip Bailey with the soprano. The high, the high notes. Gladys Knight in the pips. Katie Lang, Ingenue. Classic. Love this album. So I used to discover music by going to the uh, record store and picking up cassettes because they were so cheap. And I think that was one that was like, I just picked it up and I played it in my car. I had a 94 and I discovered a lot of music in the car. Janet Jackson, Control, her, her, this wasn't her debut album, but this might as well have been, because this is the one she broke out on. And Ronstadt, uh, with Ronstadt, featuring Aaron Neville, Cry Like a Rainstorm, How Like the Wind. Aretha, 1987, this guy, this has, um, uh, I Knew You Were Waiting on there, I forgot what else is on there, but. The Dream Girl soundtrack, the original Dream Girls. So I know this has a. Uh, this is with the cast. I think this is just kind of a casting, like uh, music from the uh, Broadway show, I think. Stephanie Mills, Home. I love this song. When I think of home, I think. Okay, I won't, I won't hurt your ears, but Stephanie Mills, oh, that's. Give her her flowers, please. Stevie Wonder, Jungle Fever. I like this album. This is really, this is 90 Stevie Wonder from that, from the movie Jungle Fever. Got another Michael Franks, Object of Desire. Another smooth, Simple Minds, Once Upon a Time. Kate Bush, The Sensual World. Love that album. That's one of my favorite albums, actually. Hall and Oates, Big Bang Boom. This has uh, Out of Touch on there. The Eurythmics, Revenge. A lot of late 80s. Most of these records were my uh, uncles. Oh man, look at this, check this out. The Ultimate in Relaxation, Thunderstorm. Before YouTube, you had to go to the, they had a section in a record store just for like rain sounds. I forgot what it was called, ambient. And then we have another Stevie classic, The Secret Life of Plants. Soundtrack to a film. Just a, um, what a great album. This is a great album. Another Stephanie Mills. 
if if I were your woman. So this is like um, another Stephanie Mills. If I were your woman, this is her version of the Gladys Knight song. But that's uh, I think that came out in '87. We have Phil Collins, um, "Hello, I Must Be Going," classic, and Bruce Hornsby, "The Way It Is." What? Just a, a timeless song. We have Phyllis Nelson, I Like You. I'm not sure, I, I don't remember this album. So I can't really comment on it, but let's get it on. Marvin Gaye. This is the old Motown cassettes. We got a, uh, this is another, this is Dead Can Dance. This is an album by Dead Can Dance, which is a kind of a goth band. From the Britain, from Britain in the 80s, old school. I think this is the greatest hits by Sinatra. Next up, we have The Supremes' Greatest Hits, Volume 2, Diana Ross and The Supremes. Never too much, never too much, never too much. Can never have too much Luther. Love, have, love that album. His first album, uh, Tchaikovsky, The Nutcracker. Got an array, got a nice eclectic mix. Um, I'm not sure if I have the cover for this, but this is Steely Dan, Gaucho. One of my favorite bands. Gotta love, gotta have, gotta love Steely Dan. Boys to Men, two. Every black household had two. Well, every household in '94, uh, they had that album. That's like their breakthrough album. Uh, Shanae O'Connor. I do I don't not I do not want what I haven't got. Classic 1990 classic album. Oh, I played this a lot when I was growing up. In Square Stir Circle, Stevie Wonder. It came out in 1985. Part-time Lover. In Excess. Um, X. This is another 1990. Great band. Another Suzanne Vega. This is her debut album. If you've seen my other videos, all my videos have one Suzanne Vega. Sade, Promise. This has a, uh, Is It a Crime? Sweetest Taboo. Stevie Wonder, Character, it's 1987. Genesis, Invisible Touch, 1986. So that's all I have. Most of them are like outside of the cover or else I don't have the case with, but I have another huge box of cassettes that's at another house. But I hope you enjoyed the video. Comment if you have any of these albums and I hope to share more with you. This is fun. I enjoy these. Take care. All right.